Josh Kerry is out suspended. Anthony Minicello is the fullback. A great debut, including two tries in game one. Matt Gidley is one centre. Jamie Lyon had a hamstring problem, but he is OK to take his spot as the other centre. Sean Timmons certainly justified his selection in game one as the 5'8". And a front six of Luke Rickardson at lock, Craig Fitzgibbon and Ben Kennedy, Robbie Kearns, Danny Badiris and Jason Riles. At fullback, Darren Lockyer. Matt Singh, Queensland's most capped origin player tonight with 16. The centres tonight, Brent Tate. Tony Carroll moves from lock forward spot out into the centres for this game tonight. Gordon Tallis, Sivan Seaver in the back row. Now, Dane Carla off the bench into the lock forward spot with Shane Webke. Yeah, Mick Crocker making his debut and Stephen Price. Bill Harrigan is about to officiate at his 20th origin match. The last 11 consecutively. Queensland have won 10 from 19 under Bill. But New South Wales have won six of the last ten. There is time on. State of Origin 2 is underway. Lock here it is with the first touch of the football. 19 away, right in the centre of the park. Now to Johns, he goes to the kick. After it is De Vere. Under it is all. Oh, it's, it's hit the referee. Kennedy has forced the ball. But I don't know that it'll be a try, although he's gone to the video. I'm not sure if it hit the referee, right? It hit the post and then came down and bounced off a New South Wales player backwards. And the question is whether Ben Kennedy got to ground the football before the Queensland player. I think he did that, I'm Pete. pretty sure he did that, Pete. And it's come, does it hit Bill Harrigan? I don't think it does. I think it's come off a New South Wales player, gone backwards, and then Ben Kennedy... Ooh, looks like he might have got there. It comes off the veer. Kennedy slippering and sliding. Does he get there in time? Yes. yes. Here comes the result. It's a try. Converts the try of Kennedy. 6 nothing. the Blues. Play back to Crocker on the 40-metre line. Lockyer goes to the left foot. And it's uh, not going to be easy to take. Tahu didn't mess about. He's trying to get back. I don't think he will. He won't give in. He passes the ball. Minicello tries the same. But this will be a line dropout. And a great chase by Queensland. A better kick to along the ground. Took a bit of time to find this one back in the end goal by Tahu. Crocker's there. And then they came for Minicello. Look at him. Half a dozen Queenslanders there. They know they're behind. They've lifted just a cog. Now Andrew Johns, he rifles it across for Timmons. Timmons running out wide on the right of the ground. He'll play at 18 metres out from the line. Now it's Matt Gidley. Gidley dummies. He slices through. Gidley is over. Try number two to the Blues. The coaching staff go up. The Blues crowd goes up. And so does the scoreboard. And at origin level, that is a soft try especially with the kind of defence we've seen in the opening exchanges here. Jason Riles, Robbie Kearns did a fine job. And now the freshmen are out there, and Matt Gidley showing the football, getting outside Shane Redke, including one other defender, and the Novo Castrians get the first two tries. Well, a simple case of Gidley showing the football, dummying, parrying, thrusting. There it goes, bang. One circus group wanted him, the car company wants him. Here's the kick by John, successful. It is 12-0, the blue. Andrew G, away for Stephen Price, and Price takes them on. They take him on as well. Fitzgibbon and Kennedy, the defence. Price is sick. And Stephen Price, a very sick young man. He's getting flush. And there's Stephen Price. Is, oh, he's having a word to the taps, Judge. He did well to find his feet. Fletcher! Beautiful ball, Jamie Lyon gets it away to Minicello, he's over, Minicello scores his third origin try. Beautiful pass by Fletcher, and Jamie Lyon, he got it on to Minicello. Lyon, who's had a great start to this game as well, finds Minicello one on one, bang into Lockyer, gets the football down, pretty good strike rate, three tries, one and a bit games. Yeah, great ball, Brian Fletcher. Once again, ineffectual defence by Queensland. They can't lock the ball up. Lyon had to turn around, find someone. And Minicello came from nowhere. His support play tonight has been outstanding. And the strength of the man, one-on-one. -on -one, bang, whoosh, gah. And over for the try. Johns from touch. From 21 out, and it's just outside the uprights. 
Now the Deeras, out to the captain. There's the kick. Devere's underneath it. Turns it back inside. It may have come off a Queensland hand, but the player didn't play at the ball. It's not played out by Matt Singh. Queensland feed. He played the ball. It was the last tackle, I'm sorry. Andrew Voss, sideline. Ray, New South Wales might have to operate with just a three-man interchange for the remainder of this match. That is Brian Fletcher going up the tunnel. It is a hamstring injury, and judging by Brian's reaction as he came off, it is not good. Confirmation, too, from the doctor. It doesn't look good. Brian Fletcher may not play any more football tonight. Cameras take us inside the New South Wales sheds, and he's, he's in a bit of pain. He's with the physio. I think half of it's pain, Ray, and the other half is frustration. He's shattered. Johns goes for the drop kick start and he finds it. It's going to be a scrum feed to New South Wales. I just had to check myself for a moment, but Johns took the drop kick restart rather than the tap. And of course, he's put all his eggs in the one basket and saying to himself, if I can do this, we'll get the loose head and the feed. Playing it on the 40 metre line, Queensland's end of the park. Now it's away for Minicello, running and showing it. Jamie Lyon fending free. And Norton it is that makes the tackle for Queensland. Inside the 30, they go to the 20, and they go to the boot of Sean Timmins. Up it goes and down it comes. It's back to Timmins. He rakes it away to Johns. Johns goes for a field goal. And Bill Harrigan says it is a field goal right on half time. Well, Andrew Johns, there's nothing left to be said. He's found the line with a drop kick from the 20 that should have been a tap, probably, in the minds of most people. And then, with nothing else on offer, he takes a drop goal with the siren in the background. The good news out of the Queensland Sheds in the second half is that Stephen Price should be right to make his return, concussed in the first half. Johns floating a ball over. It was almost an invitation for an intercept, but here's Bailey! Breaking free, he's going down to the 20 metre line. He gets rid of another, that is a tremendous run. Last tackle, what a run from Bailey. They might run it again with the defence still getting back. Johns puts the kick in, looking for the jump from Tahu, but it's gone over the sideline. Well, and it's coming back to the... This is one of the greatest runs you'll ever see in Origin football, football let alone by a prop forward. Smashes off Tony Carroll, beats another one, Carlaw, runs away from Scotty Sattler, and he go away. He goes. All of a sudden, he's confronted by the fullback one on one, so he crashes over the top of him. Kennedy and Luke Bailey, who wobbled out of the tackle. He's quite groggy, actually. Luke Bailey, the ball to ground. Queensland dive for it, but New South Wales beat them to the punch. Played by Sean Timmins. Now it's away for Craig Wing. Luke Bailey in back play is getting some attention from a trainer oh, he's just got a stitch right penalty goes to the blues to make it 19-0 here comes the kick never ever deviated right on the 20 meter line devere back for minicello stands and unloads for johns and johns goes wide fighting tahu steps away from hegarty steps away from carroll Left Carlaw grasping at mid-air. He will play the ball 10 metres out from the line. Then from Baderas, now for Johns. Johns takes it to the forward. Two metres out from the line. Plays it back for Danny Baderas. Away for Timmins, and Timmins is again very close for New South Wales. Baderas runs across, delivers for Johns. Johns has wrestled down on five. 19-0 New South Wales with their captain playing the ball. Timmons puts a little kick in. Hegarty didn't get a hand on it. New South Wales, they fight for possession. And Gidley, I think it's Gidley who has got the try. Well, is it Gidley or is it Tahu? A wonderful kick there from Sean Timmons. Not normally his responsibility, but as Ray pointed out, Johns was playing the football. Puts it behind Tony Carroll. Berrigan doesn't play at it. Shannon Hegarty comes flying in, misses it completely. Who gets the hand on the football? There's Gidley, there's Tahu. Give it a Tahu. Give it a Tahu. Eight metres in from touch and he misses. He's a man they could be looking for. Hasn't even limbered up, I will tell you, though, that Phil Bailey loosening up for New South Wales. 
Berrigan with a couple of kicks ahead. Now Higgity comes at the ball, but Minicello is there in front of them. Yeah, great work by Berrigan. They need a little bit more of that Queensland. But well, once again, that man Minicello was, uh, he was terrific there on the spot. Turned and chased and good defence. Good defence by the Maroons. Ben Eichen. Webke. Out wide, running off a receiver. Gets up and <laughs> takes a swing at Phil Bailey. Webke and Bailey, they stand and go toe to toe. Tellers goes in. Well, this is very unusual. You don't see Shane Webke react like this too many times during a football game. I think he threw the first one, Pete. He, he did, absolutely. And he took great offence at something that Phil Bailey did. I don't think said in the tackle. Didn't have a few words as well. Made him restless. Well, Riles and Satlap, they've parted from the main scrimmage and conducted their own battle. There's Bailey. Oh, that's, yeah, that's what we didn't see. And then uh, Shane Wicky reacted accordingly and then chased hard. Now, from wing, it's gone out to Minicello and he throws a dummy and he keeps going. He's run across there to Jamie Lyon. Lyon with the ball and forced back. That's the man I'm talking about. He's a will of the wisp. Youngest player on the ground. 21 years and 108 days. The kick ahead for Matt Singh is good. He puts another one on it. It'll probably beat him to the dead ball. It does. Goes back for Lockyer. It's a big kick over towards the Eastern Grandstand. The bounce came off Crocker. Crocker goes on, puts the ball over the line. This will make interesting viewing. Bill Harrigan's going to point to the spot. Yeah, well, Bill was happy with it. And Michael Crocker's persistence has paid off. He just kept chasing this football. And he is on side, yes. And no New South Wales player got near this ball. The perfect kick. Pulled it down, that right arm ooh, carrying the football, never hit the deck. It looked like he lost control at the end. It just comes out, but he bangs it down into the okay? I've got to say, I am surprised Bill Harrigan didn't at least go to the video referee, but he was happy with that. And just reward for Michael Crock. He's done well in his debut game. He might get a few more matches in her own jersey. I was of the opinion that he knocked on, but the try has been given. I'm amazed he didn't go to the video. It is 23-4, the Blues. Now Kearns, back to Timmins, and across to John. And John's out for Gidley. Gidley, Gidley gets it away, Tahu. Tamana has scored. That was beautiful hands. I thought Gidley was going to go in and score perhaps his third try. Yeah, it's a Newcastle connection here. Firstly, they go to Timmins, and then a second receiver, Andrew Johns. And Matt Gidley runs into the hole. So he got the ankle tap to some degree. They come wide. Gidley looks like he'll score. Tahu had some problems with his hands early in the season. What about this for a pickup? On his boot laces, in difficult conditions, catches and dives in the one motion. Sensational stuff. Good finish to this Origin game. That wraps it up for the Blues, no doubt about it. Here's Johns from the sideline. And this one is wide. And scoring some superb tries. Johns working the play again. Tahu down the right side. Kicks for himself. Looks for the regather, but he's beaten to the punch by a maroon jumper. Just over a minute of time. Series 22 is about to be won by the Blues. Travis Norton. He's pulled down on the 40-meter line. State of Origin scoreboard over 24 years is about to come all square. Oh no, Ben Kennedy signals straight to the sideline. And now Minicello takes it across and escapes the tackle of Norton, but he's put down by Crocker. The siren, the siren in the background. New South Wales have won Origin 2. A 27-4 victory, five tries and three goals and one field goal up against one try for the Queenslanders. 27-4, it goes back to back with their win at Suncorp Stadium in Origin 1. <laughs> That'll do, mate.
then it'll do me too.